This is question 26. The College Board is asking us to solve a system of equations for y, and so I'm going to eliminate the variable x. I notice if I multiply the first equation through by 3 and the second equation through by 5, my x components will cancel. So 3 times 5x is 15x. 3 times y is 3y. And I have to multiply the a by 3 also to get 3a. And the same thing for the second equation, which I'll multiply by 5. And that gives me negative 3x times 5 is negative 15x. Negative 2y times 5 is negative 10y. And 5 times 5 is 25. When I add these two equations, 15x minus 15x is 0x. 3y minus 10y is negative 7y equals 3a plus 25. Dividing 3 by negative 7 to get y by itself, because they're asking for the y value of the solution, I get y equals, I can pull the negative out front, negative 3a plus 25 over 7. And I could distribute the negative to the 3a and the 25. y equals negative 3a minus 25 over positive 7. And that is choice A. College Board often asks you to solve a system of equations. And they like to put in a twist so that you have to solve it by a different method than you may prefer. So make sure you're proficient with a variety of methods of solving systems. And come back soon for my next video. With math, there's always more.